Now, an Australian pro surfer has been praised for running into rough seas in Hawaii to save a woman from drowning. Well, here you can see Mikey Wright sprinting towards the waves after realising someone was getting swept away in the strong current. He then entered the water, which was full of sharp rocks, to reach the woman. He had to battle to keep hold of her as the waves crashed. Pretty strong waves there. He uh, hit them both off their feet, as you can see. And Mikey eventually got her to the safety of the beach. I'm very pleased to say we can speak to him now. Thank you so much for coming on the programme. Uh, thanks, Ace, for having us. So just, ru just quickly run through what, what you saw out of the corner of your eye and, and the split-second decision you made to, to go in there and help. Yeah, we were, we were literally just sitting up here on our, like on our like, uh, backyard and uh, we seen this lady getting swept off her feet and um, it straight away clicked that, hey, she's actually going to be in a serious bit of uh, danger here. And, you know, the rocks that she's on, um, it's like all volcano rocks, so it's very sharp. And um, she literally was just getting dragged off the rocks down, um, you know, out into the ocean and um, out into where the waves are, you know, they were 10 foot plus. Um, you know, obviously when, by the time I'd got down there to her, there was, you know, the sets weren't as big, which was lucky, um, lucky for her and, and myself. But, um, but yeah, as, as soon as I seen it, I was like, this, this lady's going to need saving. So I, um, yeah, jumped, jumped the fence and ripped my shirt off and, and yeah, just ran, ran straight down the beach as quick as I could. And, um, yeah, just, you know, assess the, assess the situation as I was running to see which was the best way and the quickest way to get to her. And, um, uh, and when, yeah, when, you, yeah. when you were in the water, there, was there any doubt in your mind? Because there were times where, you know, you weren't obviously with her straight away. Did you think, actually, this could have gone worse? Um, no, I, as soon as I was getting closer to her, as soon as I dove in the water and started getting towards her, I just said, come towards me. Like, don't try and go straight in because, you know, that, that's where the sharp rocks were um, and underneath her. I was trying to get her to come down the line further, which was towards more sand, uh, where it's more sand and less rock. Um, but you know, it's you know, if you know, if if the waves had been you know bigger uh, when when I was out in the water with her, it could have gotten you know a, a lot da more dangerous. But yeah. um, you know, as soon as I had a hold of her, I just said, "Hey, we're going to be okay. Like you're you're okay. We're going to get in." And um, you know, as soon as I, I kept repeating that to her over and over. Every wave that hit us, I'd say again, hey, we're okay, we're going to get in, the, you know. Amazing. Okay. I, I, was, was, she say anything, was she saying anything back at that point? At that point, she was just like, okay, okay. And I, I just kept, yeah, she, she pretty much was only saying okay. And I said, do not let go, just hold on to me. And, um, you know, that's why my, my sister was actually on the beach and she, she'd warned me that there was a double up coming. Um, that's why I picked her up and and kind of just jumped into the into the wave, copying the the hit of the wave um, on my back, um, and then we kind of got pushed down into the rocks a little bit. Um, you know, it's you know she she had already got scratches all over her body, and um, you know I, I got some down my back and a lot across my arms and stuff. But you know for for the situation we were in, we we both came out you know pretty unscathed, and you know at the end of the day she's she's safe now, and and um, you know to get her up the beach right. and. To uh, to see how how thankful she was, and to see her son. Her son came running running down the beach at the time. I didn't know it was her son, and he just latched onto me and just just was hugging me and didn't let go for you know for a minute, and just was just kept saying thank you so much. You you saved my mom. You know I thought she was gone, and um, you know it just goes to show like things can change in a second over here, and if you're not confident in the water, like it, it, you know even that situation, if you were confident, you would still be you'd feel like you're in a bad yeah. situation. Yeah, well, thank goodness you were there. Thank goodness for your local knowledge and well done for all your efforts. Uh, a remarkable story. Mikey Wright, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.